we are now on the road to 200 subscribers so be sure to subscribe and leave a like because i make nba content just like this every single day so there there's your reason right there all right welcome back to this madden 20 my career yes now i went by you know the face of the franchise the actual story mode pretty quickly i only had two episodes both were around 20 minutes 18 to 20 minutes both episodes so if you're not go check those out check it out before you know you watch this our nfl debut but i'm just gonna say this right now um for the draft combine i kind of blew it on purpose so i wouldn't get drafted by the raiders or dolphins which it seemed like every single team i mean not team every single youtuber got drafted by but i just watched an rbt video and if you actually play good uh you get drafted number one to the broncos Tells that bull. I, I wish I knew that earlier, but doesn't matter. We are on the Bengals, which I'm actually kind of like the Bengals. They got AJ Green, they got um Tyler Boyd, Tyler Eifert. Is it Tyler Boyd? I don't know, but I know that. But the thing about getting drafted so late is the fact that yeah, you start off as a 59 overall. It's pretty tragic. So right now I played through all the preseason, and I got to a 66 overall. And why I'm not really angry with that is because. I actually get time to upgrade my player. I actually have to play the game and somewhat grind, somewhat, to get my overall up. Because if you get drafted, like, to the Raiders or Dolphins, which is, like, the 26th pick, which is, like, where everyone got drafted, uh, your overall is, like, a 79 instantly. 73, then you get to a 79. I don't know what that message was. But that's basically what happens. I didn't know you were that low of an overall when you get drafted that late. But it kind of makes sense. But enough talking, we are going up against the Seattle Seahawks as well as the Supersonics. And I just want to express, um, this this is probably the best division in the NFL now that I'm on the Bengals. The Ravens, Steelers, Bengals, and Browns were all now playoff contenders. I'm not saying realize, I'm saying because I'm here. But yeah, this, this is definitely, with the AFC West, one of the hardest divisions in football. I'm going to show you my sliders real quick. Not my sliders, my settings. I want all pro to start off till I get to a high overall because all Madden's going to be a B. Uh, quarter length on six minutes. I'm actually going to turn Excel clock off. I don't know why that was on in the first place. But we are going to face the Seattle Seahawks going up against Bobby Wagner, a 99 overall, one of four. So let's hope we can actually win. The Zach Taylor era begins in Cincinnati. It's the coach. This is week one of the NFL on EA Sports. Coming up, the Bengals have a new man calling the shots. Zach Taylor, the second youngest coach in the entire league as they head to Seattle to take on the oldest coach in the league, Pete Carroll of the Seattle Seahawks. I'll be back at halftime with a look at the games in progress. But first, let's get up to Seattle. Standing by are the guys in the booth, Brandon Godden, and Charles Davis. Thank you, Coach. We are in the Pacific Northwest as we get set for football at Century Link Field here in Seattle. This crowd, as we've come to expect in recent years, as loud as any in the NFL, and they get even louder when their Seahawks are introduced. All right, we have ball first, actually. I forgot to mention, if you're new here, be sure to subscribe because I make NBA content every single day. And only, looks like only two players on our team have the X-Factor ability, which is me and A.J. Green. At least on offense. I don't know about our defense. But we're going to start off with a Joe Mixon run, and he's going literally nowhere. And you know those after friends so, that we have. no matter my overall, because uh, Andy Dalton's an 81. Right. Right. If you play all the preseason games, depending on how good you are, you will mean you will be the, the starter no matter what. I didn't play the greatest in the preseason, but I played pretty good. I didn't play bad. Sometimes you play like really good in the first three games, or you're high enough overall. You don't have to play week four. But I had to play week four. And then I was in the So, I'm on AG Green going that far because... I really don't have good, you know, deep accuracy or just deep power period. So I, I want to actually complete passes. There we go. And AJ Green also got belted. Now I actually really like my superstar ability or X Factor actually. Uh, making executive passes with five plus yards in the air. I got two out of three so far, and it's actually really nice. Honestly, you'll see it in action. But basically, you get the ball out a lot faster. I, I just got it right there with AJ Green, my boy. 
Bam. You get the ball out a lot faster, and I guess more accurately, I believe it is. The fastest players in the league. Looking pretty lit. Oh, also highlights the first open receiver, but Tyler Eifert. Look at that. At least it's realistic. Tyler Eifert is extremely injury prone, but come on. Listen, I'm in my X Factor ability. I'm looking for a big game right now. I need something. We're going to have, you know, this is my favorite route. It's the end route. We're going to have AJ Green going there. Looking, 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 looking. Throw it away. Throw it away. That was, I, there was no one. Second and three. I see R1. I have to look at that. Look at that. Oh, Joe Mixon. Huge, huge damn catch. I was going to say carry, but those are running. Oh, wow. That was a good play. Look at that. 21 yards. Right there on that one play. I'm looking for a touchdown. I need a touchdown. I'm, not, I'm probably not going to be looking for AJ Green on this play. Back to throw. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, oh. And now I'm out of my zone. Beautiful. Yeah, the tight end is going straight to the end zone. Touchdown. I can't say your name. First touchdown in the NFL. Oh, boy, that was tough. That was tough. The Seahawks defense was murdering us then. It was straight up just murdering us. But we did get the job done. We got the touchdown with, the, I can't say your name, but you're the backup tight end. You came in clutch. Play chess. Guys like you, you're yeah, looking for AJ Green. Big My number one guy. That's why I was looking for AJ Green. Let's go. That's why. That's why I was looking for him. One more 20 plus yards completion to him, and he's in the zone. I see you, AJ. They all short passes, but they're leading for a lot of yards. And I think I'm in the zone now. I think I might be in the zone. No, one more pass. Okay, I guess I'm not even close. That, that, was that not for five plus yards? Am I actually that stupid? I don't believe that. AJ, we're going with this cheesy route again. Hopefully AJ Green is wide open again. He is. He is. He is. AJ Green! Touchdown, Bengals! AJ Green! Once again, on that cheesy route, I thought that defender right in front of him was going to pick it off. But no, we are going to go up by possibly 10 points on the Seattle Seahawks. And they're going to score a touchdown, but that's okay. Basically, six minutes left. All we got to do is run out as much time as possible and hopefully get a touchdown. Why would you run left? Right there, right there, right there. Tyler Boyd! Huge catch! Now, first down, it's our game now. The clock is our best friend. Going with Joe Mix again. I'm doing it. I'm going straight to Joe Mixon. Straight to Joe. First down, Joe Mixon! Clutch! He might have fumbled twice. But he's coming in clutch when we need it. Oh, I put myself in a hole, didn't I? Okay, we just need our first down hole again. Triangle! Let's go! We went out of bounds, but we got the first. That's game. That's game. You just got to run and hope Joe Mixon. QB Neal. Kneeling it, that's it. And we do it. 66 overall starting QB. Went his first game against a pretty damn good team in the Seattle Seahawks. Our defense came in clutch. Clutch, clutch defense. Oh, I can't believe we actually won that game. I was getting nervous. Honestly, the way we started, that fumble. They may have one more rushing yards than us, but I outplayed Russell Wilson. Look at that QB stats. I had a 103 QB rating, which is very good for a 66 overall. 22 completions, 35 attempts, 250 yards, and two touchdowns. That's unbelievable. And Russell Wilson, not a great game with that interception, only a touchdown. It's all good in the end, bro. It's all good in the end. Chris Carson with a touchdown. Joe Mixon both had very, very similar games, except Joe Mixon fumbled twice. Uh, Receiving-wise, we got A.J. Green, 10 catches, 123 yards, and a touchdown. Unbelievable. He's he's a god. We had Tyler is Tyler Boyd. All right. We had Tyler Boyd with four for 32, eight yards on average, no touchdowns. Then we had our backup tight end come, grab a touchdown for us, and basically gave us the win essentially. And before we sim, we have a message from Emily Atwood. I think I promised. Oh no, I just got a W. I think I promised like four touchdowns, something like that. Uh, but apparently. It was either get like, oh no, it was break a rookie record or 
get um the win. I did pick the rookie, break the rookie record, but I guess getting a win also counts because I didn't break any records. But uh, you have no idea what you've done for me. Okay, so there we go. I got a thousand XP that's actually going to be very helpful for us as we are 1-0 to start this season going up against 49ers next episode ooh, ooh, ooh. you also will be seeing you know the, the debut of my new running back if you message breakout teammate who's this oh John Ross dude Johnson you got an awesome arm man you made me look really good in this week's win thank you John Ross keep looking my way bro we got some good chemistry and I appreciate I like stuff like this Boost Ross development tree. Get him two touchdowns or a hundred yards. Oh, okay. Well, I guess I'm looking for John Ross next game. Uh, oh, no, nope, now we're going up against Richard Sherman. Okay. Hey, dude, looking forward to playing you this week. If you know what's good for you, you'll be throwing the ball away from me all day. Uh, I'm just going to praise him. I'm a nice guy. I hate you, man. I respect your game. Can't wait to test myself against you this week. Man, I love a quarterback who knows his place. See you on the field. Don't worry, Sherman. I I'm going to spank you. Don't you worry about it. Don't you worry a damn about it. One upgrade. Okay, we got one upgrade. Before we end it, we're upgrading. We're going to upgrade Field General. Get ourselves to a 67 overall. Fucking Gucci. Looking Gucci. That's gonna be for me. Leave a like if you guys did enjoy. These are my stats. Leave a like if you guys did enjoy. Subscribe if you are new. GG.